What's going on guys? Dennis and Ted's with the used bike spotlight, or should I say the barely used bike spotlight? That's right. You're looking at a Harley Davidson 1200 V. Now the V stands for 72. I didn't want to say 1272 because then you're going to be like, wow, when they increase the motor size on the 1200? No, 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 no. It's a 72. It's a new model, okay? They just came out. This is a 2012 right here. Don't believe me? Go to the 10th digit of the VIN number and you're going to see a C. That means it's a 12. That's why I said it's a barely used bike spotlight. Now, the Harley Davidson 72 is probably one of my favorite bikes they've come out with in a little while anyway, just because of the old school styling. Anybody who's seen me do these videos knows I love the old school styling. Now, a lot of people will tell you that the 72 is actually a deflection to when the time period this is a representative of. But aha! You know me, I like little interesting trivia bits. The 72 is actually a tribute to Highway 72 out on the west coast in California. Harley did this as a pattern after the bikes because when they were going down there, that's what they saw. Hard candy styling paint, bobber minimalistic setups, and an awesome old school putt, and that's what they gave us. Now, this one's got some extras on it, okay? Traditionally, the 72 only comes with a standard one-up that one saddle and no backrest. The previous owner of this model wanted to take it a step further, and he did so. He did so by popping a stage one on it, Vance and Hines short shot staggered pipes, a rally runner seat, and a quick detachable backrest back here with that old school flare. Beautiful setup, they did a really good job on it. One thing that some people not necessarily are tickled pink about whenever they deal with the 72 is the brake lights are in the turn signals. You don't have an exterior brake light. Now, this one, they went ahead and they added an aftermarket brake light here that fits beautifully into the fender. Okay, really looks nice on the bike. Other than that, you do have a nice set of Harley-Davidson grips up here. You've got the matching foot pegs as well as a shifter peg to boot. And I don't know if you've noticed that nice red illumination, but those are Harley-Davidson LED lights that go with it. And of course, you can adjust them to brighten them, to dim them, or to set them up to strobe, however you want to do it. Awesome setup. Now, brand new, 2012, I've got one on the floor right now, would cost you $10,795. Plus you have 440 freight and setup. That's just typical whenever you're dealing with a new bike. This bike right now, $99.95. As it sits with all the goodies. You're still dealing with a 2012. Guys, this is a phenomenal opportunity for anybody looking for a great old school putt. Oh, by the way, did I mention the thing's only got 267 flipping miles on it? For crying out loud, man, I do that in a weekend. That's, that's not even, a, that's like your trip out. That's not even on the trip back. What the heck? I mean, it's enough to make a sane man crazy or drive me sane. I'm not sure which way it would go. But either way, give me a call, all right? Phone number here is 618-462-3030. Remember, ask to speak to Dennis, the ugly guy in the ugly cap, or just come on down. Come and see me. I'll let you take it for a spin, let you run it around. Trust me, you'll fall in love with it. The 12-inch baby apes, the classic styling, the mini tank. It's a beautiful bike. It's fun to ride. And well, I'm going to go do just that. So if you don't call me, hit me up via email, Dennis at Ted's Motorcycle World.com, or like I said, get your butt on in here. This one is going to last.